girl. I almost took this hair loose without recording this video. Chat. So, what's up, y'all? This your girl, Gold Mouth. Coming at you guys with the takedown. Y'all said y'all wanted to see it. I know I got a little glitter on my fingers. I just got done doing my nails, girl. Video coming soon. <laughs> so, I had done took this out. But, anyways, I got some bobby pins in here still. Ooh, where they, where they going? And take them to. I think I had two bobby pins. That's all I had in here was two bobby pins. So, I'm going to start taking my hair. But before I take my hair out, I'm going to spray it a little bit. And, uh, let me let me back up a little bit. Let me back up just a little bit. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna spread a little bit back here. So it seems to be a little bit need a little bit of moisture. So before I start touching it and things, I want to get it a little bit more moisturized than it is. And I'm just gonna start taking it loose, girl. That's it. Just gonna start taking it loose and then we're gonna see what my next style gonna be. But not that. I mean, first we got. I gotta wash it, and 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 I think I'm gonna color it. I don't know yet. I don't know yet, but I think I'm gonna color it. So, okay, my battery hair died. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. So I'm just gonna take this hair down, and I'm gonna fast forward it while I'm taking it. My hair, for some reason, it seems a little like it needs a little moisture. I don't like to play in it when I feel like any type of sign of dryness. I'll spray it a little bit. So if y'all see me like add some uh some more uh S curl spray in it as I go. I'm doing it because it might feel a little bit dry in that area um to the touch okay so I'm just gonna keep going taking it down and I'm probably gonna fast forward the rest of this video but if I do that then y'all ain't gonna, ain't gonna have nobody to talk to while I do this so I'm gonna keep going oh ain't I hope that ain't matted up right now okay so i'm gonna keep going and taking my hair down because i know you guys said y'all would love to see the takedown so i'm taking it down for you guys i love you guys so much <sighs> oh so i'm trying to go i'm i'm barely like taking i'm not running my fingers through my hair i'm just kind of pulling it apart as you can see and i'm not like running my fingers through it um as of yet I'm not going to run my fingers through it too much. I'm just going to kind of pull apart the areas that seem to be a little bit, uh, I won't say matted because I don't feel no matted areas, but you know, look like they might've been getting ready to mat if I'd have left it in another week. So, um, that's that, you know, y'all know it's only, um, full plait, so it ain't full braid, so it ain't going to take much for me to take down. Oh, oh, kill him, kill him. I'm just gonna do that. Maybe I should just leave the whole thing regular. Maybe I should just like not fast forward this and just take it out since it ain't but four of them. Yeah, I think I'll just do that. Anyways, y'all, how y'all did been going so far? Ooh, that three weeks did me, you know, did pretty good. It didn't mat up. That's what that's what I was trying to avoid my hair matting up because it usually mats up right here in the back area. And it did pretty good. So happy about that. I don't feel like any like super super duper matted areas i hope y'all can see that yeah so any super duper matted areas so that's a good thing y'all that's a good thing um did y'all do y'all protective style this week if y'all did y'all let me know what kind of style y'all got in y'all hair because i be wanting to know because y'all know i can't see y'all but y'all can see me so i mean if you got a protective style in your hair and you on Instagram and you follow me, tag me so I can see your hair, boo. I want to see what y'all um doing for y'all hair growth journey, you know? Oh, it's just a little dry up there, so add me a little edge curl spray. And um, keep it going. Keep it going. Okay, yeah, like I said, add, tag me on Instagram in your picture. Don't be tagging me nothing crazy. Just tag me in your picture of your hair. And um, so I can see what kind of style you got. If you follow me, you know, if if not, then um, I think your page got to be open for me to see it. I don't know how that works. But y'all know my Instagram private. Anyway, I had to do that because I had too many um, spam folks trying to add me and I ain't got time for all that. I'd rather have regular people following me and all the hair companies in the real and all the people who trying to get me to uh, showcase their waist trainers and all of that. I ain't got time for all them folks. I ain't gonna, I don't think I'm gonna do any other sponsored ads no more unless it's something that I really, really, really like. 
you know. I don't, you know, yeah, it just is what it is. I can't be doing all that stuff and stuff I might not like and people want me to, hey, you review this for me? I ain't gonna review it unless I really, really like it, you know? I done did a lot of that in my past and I ain't, I ain't doing that no more. So anyways, y'all, um, how, how my hair looking, y'all? Let me know how my hair looking to y'all. I don't think it grew in these three weeks, but shoot, I hope, I would hope so, <laughs> but I know it didn't. It's only been three weeks. Um, I did get a lot of, like, damage, I mean, not damage, um, new growth looking areas, but I doubt that was new growth. I think that was just my hair, just had got nappy all over again. <laughs> Cause it ain't been long enough for me to even grow no hair. I'm just re-moisturizing my hair, y'all, so that way, when I do get ready to detangle it, all of this moisturizer, all of this X curl spray will be done, set in and soaked in, so I can detangle it. Man, I'm about to have me a dirty twist out, a dirty braid out, girl. You better stop, how? How you better? You better stop, how? Oh, oh, y'all. I don't know. Let me do the other side. Okay, I need to wet it because I feel more comfortable running my hands through it while it's a little damp. Wait a minute, what's that? That's that's breakage. Okay, girl, that's I got scared for a second, girl. Don't do me like that. Don't do me like that. So I am currently, ooh, I don't even know how many post weeks post relaxer I am. When I find out, I'll let you guys know because I don't know. I don't even know when I did the relaxer no more. I got a relaxer update video on here that was done probably in, um, is this July? So I think I did my relaxer in June. I don't know. I did my relaxer in June at the beginning of this month, I believe. So they remember a couple weeks post. I don't think I'm six weeks post. I know that. I don't think I'm six week post. But either way, child. Whenever you're taking your hair loose, make sure your hands got some kind of slip to them and um, not your, not too much slip that it's going to cause your hair to, you know, stretch out easily, but enough slip that it's going to cause your fingers to kind of glide through um, taking it out. So I recommend when you're taking your hair, put some kind of oil or some kind of moisturizer um, in your hair before taking it out. I ain't say wet it now. Now don't go get in no shower and drench it wet because then it's gonna be too moist. Um, so you want to have uh, some sort of moisture in your hair because it eases, helps ease the process of taking it down and it helps your hair um, come apart easier. Don't ever, ever take it loose when it's wet. Lord, I wish somebody would have told me that long, long time ago because I used to pop my naps all the time, popping naps when my hair was dry, and I thought the best way to take my hair loose is was when it was bone dry, like bone dry, and I realized it was a whole lot of hair in the comb versus taking it loose when it's a little damp and you get less um, hair in the comb. You will see a big difference if you add moisture to your hair when you're taking it down versus if you do not, okay? You will see it. It will show up in that comb. Comb don't lie. That breakage in that comb does not lie. So I'm going to spray that side down. Let y'all see that. Spray that side. Y'all check out that nape. I don't know what the nape doing. We'll, we'll cover that in another video. So I'm going to, to proceed to take this one down and girl you better stop far away you today loose like this loose as a goose you better stop with them curls the curls popping y'all so um gently take those ends down that's why i don't like to do a whole lot of braids in my hair because i do not i really 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 do not almost hate the fact that i have to take the ends down like this take ends apart that's why you used to see me in that um beehive braid that only had one end that i had to worry about because your ends are like the most sensitive part one of the most sensitive besides your edges and your nape um of your hair especially when you're taking your hair loose because that's where it's gonna pop off first is your ends right here right down here at the bottom that's why i used to have that one braid that went around and around and around so i won't have to worry about taking a lot of ends loose 
that's why that was why and it helped my hair a lot but it wasn't so cute you know i would have to always wear a wig and all of that stuff and it's summertime and I, if mm -mm, i can't i can't have that one braid i do have on my hats you know the majority of the time but still at the same time nah it's i do it in the winter when i could cover it up a little bit better put that one braid in and winter time, speaking of winter, it's almost coming. I sure hate it. I don't want it to come. I do not like winter. You know, it was good seeing snow last year and all, but I'm I'm not a cold person. I'm a hot person. I come from a hot state, one of the hottest states in the United States, you know, and I like that. I like the heat. Florida is my home, is my where I'm from, and I love uh, the heat. And it's called the Sunshine State for a reason because it's always hot. Even when it's cold, well, it's hot, you know? So, I am not looking forward to winter. Are you guys looking forward to winter? I just want to know if y'all looking forward to winter because I'm not, I don't, I don't care for it at all. I'll be like hibernating and I'll be sad because I can't go outside and all of that stuff. And I'm just cold in the house. I got to have a heating blanket and a heater in my room and heating covers and all kind of stuff. So... And this one is going to be a bad winter um, as far as me in the house with my heater on because my husband don't like to turn the heater on. He like it cold and I like it hot. So, oh, girl, you better do that twist out. Or oh, is it braid out? You better do that braid out. Come through braid out. Oh, kill him. Wow. I didn't think it was going to look this good. I think it looked good. What y'all think? Do y'all think it looked decent? I mean, it looks like I could wear it. I ain't going nowhere. I mean, I can wear it around the house. Look, I'll probably wear it for a day. And um, we'll see. Just to wear it. And show y'all what kind of, what I could do to it for a day or so. I don't know, girl. I kind of kind of think it's alright. You know, I kind of think it's alright. You know, for a little. What y'all think? Y'all let me know. Okay, y'all. That's it. I took the whole thing loose in one video. With no uh, fast forwarding. So, okay, y'all. Y'all see. How that turned out. Let me know what y'all think. There we go. Good shot right there. Okay, y'all. All right, y'all. That was the takedown. Thank you guys for watching. And um stay tuned to see what I do next, y'all. That's all I got to say in this video. And I will holler at y'all later. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Okay, and I will holler at y'all later. Bye.